good morning today again we are continuing the lesson physical fitness wellness and lifestyle the topic that we will discuss today that components of wellness components of wellness uh physical social emotional spiritual nutritional financial and intellectual and environmental wellness physical wellness social wellness emotional wellness spiritual wellness nutritional wellness financial wellness intellectual wellness and environmental wellness we will discuss these all physical wellness in detail nutritional wellness we will discuss in detail psychological wellness we will discuss in detail social wellness also we will discuss in detail spiritual wellness we will discuss in detail environmental wellness we will discuss in detail financial wellness we will discuss in detail so first we will come to the physical wellness physical wellness the physical wellness includes the following areas first one is physical appearance physical appearance how we uh, uh, represent our body how we are looking so this is outlook of the body so the physical appearance can be improved by various ways that first of all that is physical activities by doing various physical activities exercises yoga and participating in various sports activities so the physical wellness can be developed in which the physical appearance we are developing by exercise and doing exercise by daily routine exercise and physical activities which should be a part of our life we must choose select yoga activities which are which has tremendous effect over the health which is very good for developing our health physical wellness also includes the good health it is good state of physiological the good working condition of the physiological systems good functioning of all the organs of the body so it also includes it comes in under the good health physical wellness also includes the personality personality is known as the pattern of knowledge thoughts and behavior we will discuss separate in the chapter of psychology and sports about the personality in detail so personality is what the knowledge the pattern of knowledge experience and behavior the what knowledge we have we have accordingly and it becomes a part of our personality so personality is also there good personality should be there good physical wellness wearing and clothings how we dress up what type of clothings we are selecting 
how we are overall representing ourselves so wearing and clothing is another part of the physical wellness hygienic habits hygiene is another very important keeping ourselves clean cleanliness of the body wearing clean clothes so the physical wellness included these things proper growth of organ and system when we are doing all these things definitely there will be proper growth of organs and systems of the body physical wellness also includes activeness we must remain active all the time so these all the areas are included under the physical wellness this is the first component of wellness we must be well and physically well and the physical wellness is including all these areas where the physical appearance is there and i have told you then how we can develop the physical appearance exercises are there physical activities are there which should be part of our life yoga activities we can include yoga asanas pranayams overall good health should be there the systems and organs should work function properly personality is there which is the pattern of thoughts knowledge and behavior wearing and clothing how we are putting clothes hygienic habits taking care of hygiene cleanliness of the body and clothing proper growth of organ and systems good developed organs properly developed systems and activeness these all are the part of the physical wellness so the exercises like we can be the part of our life which can give overall good effect over the physical wellness they are helpful for developing the physical wellness various physical activities exercises and yoga asanas can be selected for performing the physical activities for developing the physical wellness another component of physical wellness that is nutritional wellness second component nutritional wellness nutritional wellness includes good eating habits definitely we must have good eating habits we must eat nutritious food we must have balanced diet we should avoid toxicants toxicants are there which are harmful for the body like alcohol tobacco pan masalas excessive fat excessive oil so we should avoid an excess amount of anything we should avoid these are the toxicant they can give toxic effect to the body we must drink plenty of water so these things can help us to develop the nutritional wellness
nutritional wellness is related that how we are selecting our food what we are including in our food what type of eating habits we have so eat healthy hygienic and nutritious food say no to junk food occasionally we can taste these items but these should not be part of our eating habits this should not be a part of our regular meal or food so nutritional wellness developing the nutritional wellness is that we have discussed so we can choose the good type good kind of food nutritious food balanced diet for the developing nutritional wellness another one is psychological wellness psychological wellness it includes good ideas because the psychological wellness is the good state of mind so it includes the good ideas we must have good ideas in our mind good thoughts and good behavior positive attitude we must have positive attitude towards the things positive attitude should be there good learning abilities we must learn properly whatever we are learning so the ability of learning can be developed for developing the psychological wellness the concentration of the mind there should be sharp concentration of the mind the mind should be focused towards the whatever we are doing creativity a mind should be creative we must have good understanding abilities so these things can help us to develop psychological wellness so some more things which can help here that i can share you that for developing the psychological wellness always go through the success stories always try to learn try to read positive stories motivational speeches motivational thoughts always try to share good things because whatever we are sharing that remains in our mind always try to be positive analytical abilities should be there we should analyze the things most common that is whatever we are sharing that remains in our mind so always share those things which we want to keep in our mind good ideas good thoughts good behavior positive attitude and try to concentrate try to do meditations which can help to improve our focus or concentration so these are the things which can help us to develop the psychological wellness we will come to the next component of wellness 
that is social wellness this is another very important part of the physical wellness social wellness includes social interaction how we are interacting with the people what type of relations we have in society either people like us or not what type of social qualities we have so it depends on the our social interaction so always interact with the people politely gently and truthfully so social interactions are very important they make us feel good and others also social behavior how you behave with the people around you so social behavior is another very important that is we have we must develop the good social behavior which will help to develop the social wellness relationship with the people what type of relationships we have built with the people true relationships either the false relationship or we do not have good relationship with the people so it depends on us that how we are building our relationship with the people of the society social ethics and values there are certain ethics of the society the values which people like in the society we must have the social ethics and social values by these social ethics and values we can easily develop our social wellness so we must have social ethics and social values like various social ethics social values are there each and every area in the society wherever you are meeting to the people you are talking with the people we are interacting with the people we are sharing something with the people we are respecting the people whatever we are doing everywhere the ethics are there how we should respect elders how we respect we should respect uh, children so everything everywhere how we should eat in society how we should sit in society social ethics are there social values are there so these things personal behavior personal wellness is quite different than the social wellness social wellness the social ethics and social values have big roles so we must have the social ethics so each and every work everything whatever we are doing in in the society and whatever is affecting others so there are ethics are there the values are there which we must know and these ethics we can learn from our parents elderly peoples or we can find some literature in the google so these are very very important i want to bring a focus again on the social ethics because social ethics social values are very very important for being a good social person because we are social animal we cannot live without society so society is a part of our life so definitely we must develop the good social values good social ethics communication skill how we are communicating with the people how you talk in which tone we are talking which way we are talking what type of words we are using what type of language we are using so everything the communication skill how we talk with the people how we communicate with the people 
so communication skills should be there helping habits we must help others always so these things can help us to develop our social wellness this is very important the social wellness to develop the social wellness now we will come to the spiritual wellness 